Hey everybody, it's me, Super Paul Games. I'm just setting up. How are you all doing? Welcome back to King Arthur the Role Playing War Game. Let's hit the button and hope we survive. I'm afraid of what's gonna happen. Oh. Oh, that's shit. Let's see, false prophets. Prophets of the Old Faith. Okay, Prophets of the Old Faith. That's great, all in the same place. Forest Giants. Awesome. Uh, she army. That's not good. That's by, I think, Sir Mark's army. No, Sir Kay's army, which is still beat the fuck in hell. And then one up here, which we don't have any army to counter it. Any chance they want to fight the prophets? <laughs> I doubt that's going to happen, but I could wish for it. I am not sure what the hell we're going to do. What about Sir Mark's army? Where the hell is Sir Mark's army? That's Sir Kay's army. I don't even know where Sir Mark is. <laughs> I should remember. It was just like this. Oh wait, is that Sir Mark's army up there? Yes, my lord. Oh, their army still beat up. Oh yeah, and Sir Bedivere, he's stuck in the forest of shit That's stuff. Can you get there? No. Can you get there? No. Can you get there? How about there? On my way. His army is too small to do much of anything good. On my way. Oh, and they're so slow. They are beat to fuck. They're trying to escape. Um, let's hit the button and hope they all leave us. They all run away. <laughs> Please run away. We can't take this army. As much as I would like to, we have to retreat and hope we don't die. Oh, we lost some bowmen. That sucks. Leave us alone. Retreat again. Oh, there's two armies they've got there? Shit. Oh, shit. This is bad, too. Why is their fighting strength down? Oh, that's their morale. Morale. Eventually, I'll get things done. Some battles have been like, man, their morale sucks, and that's their movement point. Well, I guess we might as well go for it. Sir Kay, you gotta pull some sort of upset here. I know we've won with Sir Kay's army before, but this army's really beat up. I think we've fought here before. We've probably fought everywhere by now. Let's, uh... Alright, we start by one of the victory locations. That's nice. There's another one. Tits McGee. Hey, what do we get for the training ground? Sound of Courage spell. I don't even know what that one is. Probably should by this point, but whatever. You can see by the numbers here, like, a lot of these guys are 28s. They're only, like, halfway done. Alright, yeah, you knights, you come here and secure this. You knights here, you run up to there and take the church. Main body of the army, can we get you, like, right here? I don't know if this will work. We have a huge morale advantage, as you can see. Not that their morale is perfect. If we could get the victory locations faster than them, that'd be probably our best way to win, because... Yeah, our army's kind of beat up still. Alright, you guys, if you can, run away over there and take the training grounds. There, we got a good start, victory location-wise. Oh, there's a victory location there, too. Let's split these guys up. Uh, one of you guys. I want one of you. You guys run over there and take that one. Fast, fast, fast. For once, we've started in a better location than the enemy, I think, victory location-wise. We want to get that red bar to go down. Run, you fat faces. Your faces are full of fatty goodness. Yeah, that's weird. All right, so we got another one. Are we close enough to do any magic yet? Oh, we are. Let's use Cloud of Shadows. Sir Wayne, use Cloud of Shadows. I don't know if this is the best use. Sir Damas, poison those guys. Oh, that's one of their leaders. That's good. Okay, form up here. Yeah, hopefully our archers can do some damage. Yeah, hurry up. Are you guys marching fast? Okay, you are running. Good. Yeah, infantry, get in and take your positions. What are they doing? Making it nighttime? Make it daytime! And I said, let there be sunlight! Sir Kay said, let there be sunlight. Make it fucking day. 
She's Dragon's Breath on these guys. As they come up. Yeah, come on, hit him, Bowman. Please, please, please. So, Damas, use Curse of Shadows on those guys back there. Oh, are they going to make it night again? We we'll use Dragon's Breath on someone. I don't care. Somebody back there. I'm more worried about what's going up up front, so I'm not going to... Let's use Lightning on these guys, can we? No. Someone back there. Boom! Come on, Bowman. The more of you guys, these guys you can hit, the better. Any of us? Make it sunshine. There we go, daytime, yeah. You guys run up there. Sir Gareth, why don't you use Cloud of Shadows? Oof. And these guys, I guess. Knights. Come up here. Other knights, you rush up here. We're doing very good when it comes to, uh, we're gonna use Sanctuary while we're at it. Sir so Kay, use Masterful Tactics. Yeah, we're gonna get all the advantages we can here in this area. Sir Damas, why don't you poison these guys? I don't know who they are. Sir Gareth, use uh, Dragon Strike on them. So much magic. Oh, he captured one, two of their guys. Yeah! That's pretty good. I wasn't farting, I was rubbing my hands on my butt. <laughs> Not really, sorry. Alright, that worked much better than I expected. We could not have got much luckier if I tried. All right, we didn't lose anybody. We wiped out their army. We got the Daylight Helmet, plus two to leadership and plus two to loyalty. I don't think we really need that. Another Ring of Come. We got a ton of those. No, don't attack Sir Mark. Don't attack Sir Mark. Go away. Uh, okay, somebody died in prison. Sir Peleus, he got the Ring of Regeneration, plus two to regeneration skill. Um, I don't know what the regeneration skill is. Oh, sir, the Camelot kid doesn't have a weapon. Fuck. I didn't know that. Can we not give Lancelot shit? Because he's not... I guess we can't. I thought he had stuff. Plus one to adventure. You know what? You don't need the trickster brooch. Here, you can take the regeneration thing. We'll give that to Sir Bedivere. Alright. Um, Sir Bedivere... Man, I don't know if you could get there and close that off. That might not be worth it. Let's see how our other armies are doing. Sir Kay, how are you doing? I don't think you guys... No, you got interrupted in filling your ranks. It's going to take a whole fucking year? Are you serious? Shit. Sir Mark, how are you doing? Yes, my liege. One more turn. Man, that sucks. It's going to take a whole year. Like, I wonder if we lost all our money for redoing that because they got stuck in the battle. Alright, Sir Bedivere, where are you? Yes, my liege. Can we take a risk and get there? I can't tell if... I don't... On my way. A renegade enchantress tells you that here you can find a path to the land of the Shi, where you must... which must be closed if you want to weaken the Unseelie. You want Sir Bedivere? I think you're the man to do it. Let me see, is anyone else better? Camelot Kid, he is good at fighting. Sir Peleus is very good at fighting. Sir Lancelot's good at fighting. Uh, we'll send, um... Damn. We'll, we'll send uh, the Camelot Kid, let him do one. When you reach the Circle of Stones, you should find the path mentioned by the Enchantress. Follow it and close it with the Iron Disc, since that is the way to weaken the Grey Baron. You're on your way to the darkest part of the woods when your pathways lead to another world. Suddenly you hear a hoarse voice, Nay! <laughs> and you notice an unseelie in a long cloak. As you get near, you hear his slow echoing voice, Mortal King! Are you heading to Tenaug? Yeah, see, I'm looking for that road. The path leads from this world to the land of twilight and dusk. Thus, it is one of the most dangerous places for mortals. But I could offer you a deal. If you do me a favor, I guarantee you could travel along this path without any harm. Camelot Kid, what's up with you? He's like, eh, what if I say no? In that case, you must fight alone against the champion of the mountains. He has never lost a duel, and you cannot defeat him either. What is my task? 
The descendants of the people you call Romans are building a new empire on the ashes of their own province. The legionaries want to close the sea road. If you stop them, I will let you pass. Somehow this unearthly warrior, unearthly warrior knows exactly why you're here. Why don't you fight them, dude? Um, why don't you fight them? Strange things have happened to the north of Britannia and to those who live there. No wonder that these Roman legionaries from that province are invulnerable to magic. Maybe the champion could defeat them, but I'm unwilling to take that risk. Oh, man. Uh, I don't know if I can trust you. I guess I'll help the... Uh, no. Uh, no, I'm going to go alone. You travel further alone. Until you reach a valley. There you see a man in the middle of a ring of stones. He holds a rune stick in his hand. He must be a champion the Unseelie was talking about. As you get closer, your heart trembles in fear and he looks invincible. Um, I guess I'm going to go back to the Unseelie and help him. Because red means I'm not going to be able to succeed. That guy looks scary. Fine, noble knight, he says. The leader has an iron disc ornament with runes. If you take this from him, they'll not be able to close the road. You shall find their camp at the end of the path near the spring in the north. But they're trying to do what I'm trying to do. I'm going to go find the Romans. You follow the directions and easily find the camp. It has only one tent in the middle, but it looks entirely different from the usual pavilions of the southern provinces. You see battle-hardened veterans around the camp. Their centurion is drawing something in the dust. Um, I'm going to go talk to their leader. Uh, I'm not going to wait till nightfall and sneak in. I'm just going to go talk to their leader. That's the way the Camelot kid works. When you arrive at the camp, some of the soldiers draw their weapons and gather into a formation. As their commander arrives, they let him through. Their officer is a tall, muscular man. Oh, dreamy. And must be a veteran of many battles. There's a long scar along his face to prove prove it. I could be like, hey, Scarface, are you the one who's in charge? But the Camelot kid is smarter than that. He's had to, you know, he was in Camelot for a while and he moved troops around. He's used to having decorum. I salute you, Centurion. I am a knight of King Arthur. My name is Gracias, and the centurion of the mighty legions. I'm the champion of New Rome that was born on the ashes of Aboracum. What brings you here, knight? I think we both want to close the path of the she. Really? And what if I don't want this? Why should I believe you, and how can I be sure you won't lead me into a trap, knight? I show him my iron disc. Interesting, he says. I met a druid, and he gave me this iron disc. I can walk the path of the she, so I shall be able to close them and thus weaken the Grey Baron, the leader of the Unseelie. Uh, I met that renegade druid as well, dude. My suspicion is that the renegade druid is the vassal of Orkney, the mysterious island in the northern cold sea. They have their own agenda, and they want to set us against the she, but I must obey my Khazar. I will close that path. I suppose we can go on together. Okay, fine, let's do it together, dude. You join Gracias, the Roman centurion. He tells you that no magic can either touch nor harm him. Thus, you should stand close to him, and that way he can protect you from the effects of vile sorcery. The path leads to the valley where you see a man in the middle of the ring of stones. He holds a rune stick. It's the same guy we saw before. Well, we're not going to be able to defeat him with magic because there's red there. We're not going to be able to use our adventuring skills because he's got none, so we're just going to have to attack him. With the battle cry that echoes yours, the Roman centurion attacks the champion, and you follow him. There's something stirring in the air, and the tide of his magic overwhelms both of you. But all the champion's efforts are in vain. In close combat, he is no match for you. You win. Suck it! Suck it hard. After you defeat the champion, Gracias walks into the middle of the ring of stones and puts the iron disc on the ground. The landscape begins to change, like waking from a vivid dream. As soon as you find yourself in your world, the Roman says goodbye. Maybe you will meet him again. So we got one point to Christian, a bunch of experience points, and we have closed two of the portals. Can we flee back to our own land? On my way. Yeah, we're going to try to now <laughs> and bravely run away. <laughs> Excellent. So I think, I don't know where the last one is. I think the last one we have to close is right there. That's problematic. A word I say a lot in here. I think that's a pretty good turn, though. Let's see. I don't know if I should yes, have had Sir Kay rebuild, but I want him to rebuild. Sir Mark, yes, you got to rebuild, Lord. too. I want to get that last thing closed. Okay, our morality chart. We're even more Christian. 
Can we get the Sangrail Knights? Oh, we can get Sangrail Knights now. Cool. And I don't know why the round table was like that. Maybe we got more ladies. Holy shit! All kinds of ladies. Ladies all over. The She's a sadist? Wow. That's creepy. Sorry. <laughs> Just all kinds of memories of my past came back to me. Not that I was a sadist. Not at all. I don't like pain. I say no to pain. Go back into the beta grade. You go back to the beta grade too? Oh, sweet. Recruitment's complete. Where is it complete? Sir Mark, your army is good. Oh, we need to get there. Oh, man. That's just too many moves. If those people... What if we get rid of these guys, the forest giants? On my way. We should be able to pay them off. Um, and I don't want to do battle with them. You want any of the ladies? We got a lot of... You want any of this junk I got? I should give that blade to... Somebody needs a blade. Uh, here's some money, giants. Just go fuck off. Right? Oh, I could bribe them and get them on my side. But I don't know. Let's just pay them to leave. Alright, we bribed the giants. Ah, oh, Sir Mark... We need to get you there somehow. Okay, Sir Bedivere. Ready to serve. Yeah, you do that. All right, we got most of his army in there. Yes, my king. Oops, that's not the army I wanted. Yes, my king. I want Ready this to army. serve. Fill up the ranks. Sweet. This is gonna take three turns. I don't know. I might have fucked that up doing that. Whatever. Sir K, you're gonna still be yes, building for a while. Where are you, Sir Mark? I guess we'll see what happens with them. Don't attack. Don't attack. They're gonna attack. Well, good luck, Sir Galahad. Defend our stronghold, please. We want to keep that. Alright, we're very familiar with this. Um, let's see. Where are all our infantry? Okay, we got... You guys will all be the first. I don't even know if this is going to work Archers. right. Archers. Oh, they should actually be the second. Archers. And then uh, you guys stay here and secure this place. Okay, first, you guys move down here. Uh, Archers. Obviously, when I make that kind of noise, eh, I'm really happy with how things are going. Infantry. Okay, you go there. Infantry. You go there. Infantry. Go there. Probably should have them move up a little bit further. Infantry. Infantry. Knights. Yeah, just want to get everybody up there. Archers. Yeah, then archers, you can feel free, free to fire at will. Archers. You guys can fire at will too. Okay, so we started with one victory. Luckily, their morale is way low. We are terribly outnumbered, but we have done we have won this battle before. It admittedly though, usually it's like with one archer unit running back. Hopefully this will be a little better this time. They still have really good units though. Sir Galahad, what kind of weapons do you have? Celestial Radiance, it destroys or uh Whoa, it inflicts between three hundred and fifteen hundred damage to all non Christian soldiers within a forty meter radius. Hopefully our Christ our the soldiers all next to you are Christian. If not, get everyone to convert, otherwise God's going to make them explode, apparently. It's a reason to go to church, dudes. Everybody, get your booties up here. Come on, go down here, morale. Go, go, go. Where are the other ones? Okay, there's one of them. Where's the other one? The far side? Man, how would I get there? I almost would have to go down this front way right by them, which I don't want to do. Yeah, there we go. Get everybody jammed up right in here. 
That's what I'm talking about. Knights, hold your ground. Everybody else, get up here. Try and kill it. Create a killing lane. Hurry up, dudes. Hurry up and get in your positions. You can actually stop there. As soon as they're in range, feel free to fire. Oh, shit. Nobody here can make a day. So we're just gonna have to kinda sit and wait. It's Uka Hachi. She's one Hachi of a lady. <laughs> Alright, Bowman. Can you, um, start shooting? No? Halt. I like how when I say halt, you decide you guys are going to run up 40 meters. Halt means halt. Good job, bow people. Everybody else, engage these dudes. Sir Galahad, let's try your celestial radiance once these guys are in range. I don't know how well this is going to go, but... I don't think it killed our guys, so... Oh yeah, yeah, you can see her hit points are going down pretty fast. Yeah, come on dudes, everybody crush that person. Crush her real good. We capture her butt. Yeah, we captured one of them. Capture the other one. Fia, fro, 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 ho, ho. Fro, ho, ho was her name. So Galahad, can you do this again? I don't know if you're gonna have enough magic for it. Oh, somebody healed her dumbass. Oh, that's not good. Somebody set a tornado off right here. Oh, and a death cloud. That's not good either. Sorry, guys, in the death cloud. Where are you guys going? I swear. I just don't listen to orders a lot of the time. They're just like, you know, I'm just going somewhere else. Why the fuck not? Ah, there goes a crossbowman, apparently. It'd be nice if our bowmen were doing something more, but whatever. Come on, capture this other person. Sir, um, Galahad, can we use your... Oh, I want to use your Celestial Radiance again. You radiant, bitch. Yeah, shoot those guys way out there. How many leaders did they have there? There's a leader there. We captured one. I think we captured another one. Oh, yeah. Decimate them. Use cleave, Sir Galahad. Yeah. I wanted to build some more troops here, but not bad. Oh, this is probably the longest LP I have ever done. <laughs> I'll be amazed if anybody has watched all the episodes, like, I would give you a high five. I'd be like, I can't believe we made it here together. We can form a support group when this is done and have a beer and cry. All right. We didn't lose any units. We lost a few guys. We got the shield of Arimathea. This is the shield of Joseph, oh, Joseph of Arimathea, which protected the saints in hundreds of battles throughout his journey into the Holy Land. Plus one mana every ten seconds for the hero. That's not very much, but... The truth is, he might not have much in the way of that. Sir Galahad, I, oh, I can't promote him or give him any of that stuff. So, we'll give some defense to your knights. King's guards will give you some melee. Griffins will give you some defense. We'll fill up the ranks here, and we'll give you another crossbow unit. And, I don't know, golden griffin, I guess. Um... No, I want the stronghold. Oh. Alright, let's see who else has gone up. Okay, that was the... Oh, shit. I gotta remember to go back to the Welsh Bowmen. Give you a bunch of bow points. I think these guys are mostly new. Griffins will give you some defense. Uh, we'll give you some defense and some melee. Give you some defense. Some defense. Oh, and you get a special skill. I'm going to give him Master Weaponry. Uh, damage bonus for his weapons. So, Gareth, let's give you um, some more rain skill. Hopefully that'll help out. I think I'll give him some more skills in Ward, too. 
Gotta protect his guys. So Damas, oh, it actually will help the Sile first. Gives him some offense. D. So Damas, give you another magic point. That seems like fun. Do you have any more poison you can get? Apparently not. That would have been nice. Um, let's get you Gift of Avalon because that... No, let's give you Pat. No, I can't get you that. It's already maxed out, Terp. Let's get you Gift of Avalon because then we can get some of these things for more mana. Sir K, why don't we give you some more leadership skills? Now you are maxed out with your masterful leadership. When he eats a lot, he has to take a leadership. Oh, oh. <laughs> All right, let's give you another... Um, Skill and logistics for your movement points. Wasn't there somebody here that got promoted? No. Oh, where is this? The Camelot Kids Army? Alright, the Bowmen we're just going to fly through and give archery skills to again. Griffins will give you two Ds and then O. Yeah, defense and melee. Uh, knight, uh, guards will give you mostly... Melee, Lancelot, we can't improve. Camelot, kid, let's give you some... I don't know, we'll give you some fighting skill, I guess. And let's give you some more magic, I guess. We'll give you um, Armor of the Faith. We'll make his unit more resilient. I don't think we really need to see this. We can see all our prisoners, I guess. A lot of them. Let's go to the Chancellery and buy some more food. Kent, why is Kent always being a dick? Come on, Kent, you're always troublesome. Bunch of dickweeds. Alright, we'll buy a bunch of food. Ready to serve. Okay, Sir K, you need two turns yet before you're ready. Where the hell is Sir Mark? Yes, my king. Sir Mark's army. I don't know if his army needs to get better or not. I do want to take that back. Sir Bedivere's army is going to take yes, a little bit yet. Yeah, at least two turns. Uh, here's hitting the turn button and praying no more she armies come out of the uh, Bedigrain. A man can dream. They want to offer me food and stuff for that guy? Fine, we'll take it. We need food. Uh, damn it, two more she armies? Fuck. Are you kidding me? Wait, and how how did ones get here? Ah, oh, tits. Royal yes, tits. It's not good at all. Are you fucking kidding me? The kidnapped lady. Someone kidnapped a lady. Great. More giants. There are giants all over the place. Can't they get real jobs? Ah, oh, damn it! That's gonna attack Sir K's army. Sir Bedivere, yes, your army is not gonna be ready for at least a turn. You know what? I am sick of this bullshittery. Yes, my king. How far can you get? No, can you get to the stone circle? On my way. Go to the stone circle, Sir Mark. I don't know if this is gonna work, but we're gonna try and make a straight run to seal the last of the seals. They're going to have an army that comes at Mark. I just know it. Tits. Tits, tits, tits. Go away. Nobody likes you. Great. Uh, oh, man. We got to hope that we do well. because We need to push on and close this damn thing because we can't keep fighting all these stupid armies. We fought here recently, I think. Didn't we? Let me see. So there's a lightning thing right by us. There's that, which protects people from magic. Grants the protect from magic spell. Okay. We're actually not in a bad position, depending on where they start. If we could take the two things in the back, we could be ahead with the morale shit. All right, we're going to try and have knights secure that if possible, and secure that if possible. Oh, shit, that's not what I meant to do. No, you guys secure that. You guys secure that. Now, nah, damn it. I spent all this time hitting the wrong buttons. 
Four I want? There we go. Where the hell is the main body of the army? Main body of the army. I don't know where the hell y'all going. Right here. Yeah, archers there. Main body of the army right up here on the hill. They must be over there somewhere. If they're all over there, we could get other stuff too, but whatever. Uh, main focus is just take what we can. Make them try and come up the hill and have to hit us. The archers, are you on auto fire? Yes. Sir Percival, can you, okay, do your death cloud. Lady, do your uh, death cloud. Sir Balin, oh, you can't do anything there. Sir Mark, you can't either. We in range? No, not in range for a lightning bolt spell, unfortunately. Can you guys go over here? I don't know, maybe they're sending troops over there. It's worth a shot, though. What's that? Protection from magic? Alright, so Percival, um, use Dragon's Breath. On these guys. Oh, shit, man, yeah! I fucked him up real good. Lady, use Shard Shit. That's not really what it's called. Oh, we, she must not... Yeah, they must not be in range. She must have a shorter range on that spell. Okay, um, where's my other cavalry units? You guys, where are you guys going? Did I tell you to go to the wrong place? You guys come up here. Wait, now I'm really confused. Where are those guys? Oh, I guess they weren't close enough to take that. Yeah, you go up there and take that. Oh, here they come. Oh, apparently they have a bunch of protection for their stuff. Come on, get rid of that stupid protection. Why don't we put a cloud of shadows right behind it anyway? There's a bunch of guys right there. Put another one from the other person right there. Yeah, that should eat them up real good. Are we fighting people over here? Oh, we're gonna be. Hopefully our knights can take that on. I don't know if they can or not. Let's use our lightning spell from our bonus thing here. Excellent. So Percival, use your, um, oh, it's not gonna work on those guys. Use your dragon's breath on those guys. We'll use crystal shards on some of these guys coming up. Oh, great! Fucking great! I didn't see... Shit. I didn't see that they magically used their teleport thing to get in amongst my, um... Guys, great. Sir Mark, where are you? Okay, use, uh, blast. Sir Balin, where are you? Use blast, too. First of all, use Dragon Strike on these guys. Excellent. Uh, use Death Cloud. Well, it's not too close to our own guys. That might have been bad. Where's our other Calvary? Did you guys take this yet? Oh, I forgot they're fighting someone here. How are they doing? Not doing very well, judging from it. We captured one of their people, though. Where's Sir Mark? So Mark, use your Dragon Strike. Good, good, good. These guys are almost dead here. They should start to be dying a lot faster. Sir Balin, no, you guys come up here. Where's Sir Balin? He's fighting somebody. We'll have them use Cleave, I guess. Come on, destroy these people. They're all right here. I guess you can go fight them if you want. I don't care. We'll use Curse of Shadows on these boners. Oh no! Oh no! You guys don't run into the don't run into that. That's not good. Just crystal shards on them. 
Oh yeah. Suck at that. Oh man, I got like almost all of them. Check that shit out. Wow, that was brutal. There we go, this battle is ours. So Percival, uh, it's good enough. I do worry they're gonna have another army that comes out though. We gotta close that last stupid ass path. All right, we got a Ring of Honor, which we don't, I don't know if we need that or not, but. Go away, no, go away. Fine. I didn't really want to do this battle in this episode, but I guess this will probably be, ideally this will be the last battle of the episode. All right, um, we're just gonna do the exact same thing we did here last time. All right, here goes nothing, or more like everything. Okay, everybody get down in here. I don't know why one guy wants to run way out ahead. I hate when that happens. You gotta find out who the one guy is. No, 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 no. It's that guy. He's like, I wanna run up here and be awesome! Sorry, dude, you'll never be awesome. <laughs> Man, it's a little harsh. All right, sweet, we got the victory location. Let's get everybody else moved up. Archers, run up there. Like, I want you guys, like, planted fast so that when they come up there, you can shoot them with your bows. Welcome to Welsh City, UK. I tell you what, the, the AI in this game isn't bad. It's, it's actually surprised me compared to some games I've played. But in this battle, in particularly, it could be a little better. I'm not complaining. Well, I guess that kind of was, but it wasn't meaning to. Look at that lady. She's got a she's a bubble. It's a bubble boy. <laughs> Hello, bubble girl. <laughs> you gonna roll up here, bubble girl? It's all good. Hey, don't run too fast. You wouldn't want to be, you know, ready to fight a war. There might not be a sense of urgency. These people. Wait, why are you guys? Uh, no, I didn't tell any of you guys to go up there. You know, I told none of them to go up there. You go here. You go here. You go here. None of you run up way ahead of everybody else. That stupid stuff. There, y'all go jamming as tight as you can right here. Oh great, someone's using crystal shards on our guy. Nice. That sucks. Nice. That was most of my favorite unit. That's depressing. That would lower my morale if I showed up and saw that. <laughs> oh great, somebody's sending a tornado. That sucks too. Oh, and they're making it night. Nice. We don't have that kind of magic. We have one guy with magic. He has celestial radiance and cleave. Cleave I don't even... Is I think it's mad. What are you guys doing over here? They're probably like, I saw that tornado. I ain't gonna stand over there. You think I'm stupid? <laughs> like, don't be silly. All right, archers, if you can, fuck these guys up as they come up here. Archers? Archers. Archers, why are you even moving? Some of you should have already been stopped by now. Shoot. Oh, you guys are stupid. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, and, uh, infantry. Use celestial... Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, use celestial radiance. Oh. Yeah, burn these guys. Burn them real good. That actually worked really well if you look at their hit points. Yeah, come on, guys. Fuck these guys up. Hey, we captured a dude. Oh, no. They're using Death Cloud on us. That's not good. <laughs> come on, kill that last guy. Can't even tell which one he is. Should be a tall guy that's not human. 
Oh, right there. It disappears when I do that. Come on, yeah! Good job, everybody. Um, you can all halt, please. Oh man, our archers took it hard. Why are you guys even... Who is this? What is this unit? No, I can't even click on these assholes. Halt! All right, uh, everybody, engage these people. Man, they got too many leaders for our good. Oh, everybody's coming up here. We've got to block the street so the archers can hit people. This is not going to be so nice. Oh, man. I don't like any of this. Sir Galahad, use your cleave. Which one is Sir Galahad? The guys in the dresses are the enemies. We captured somebody, that's cool. Where are you, Sir Galahad? You might be on a... You should be standing next to the horses. Oh, damn it, I can't see. I think that's Sir Galahad with the mighty glowy sword. Not that guy, but the one right there on the horse. Oh, there goes some of our guys getting their asses kicked. That's great. I think we're gonna win this battle, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah! Fuck it. I mean, suck it, she. Uh, you would think we would bother to close the gates at some point, or put up gates at least. We defeated them. We lost a few people, but no units. We got an amulet of clairvoyance. And, uh, oh, great. Another battle? Well, this is going to have to wait till next <laughs> episode. Thanks for watching, everybody.